this is the all new 2023 Genesis GV70. Let's begin this review with the MSRP price on this vehicle. This 2023 GV70 Sports Prestige Edition comes with a pro total price tag of $57,765. Here are all the options that come along with it as well as the Sports Prestige Package. You can have a good read through them by pausing this video or even checking out this exact vehicle which is located at the headquarters Genesis, Sanford, Florida. So do go ahead and check them out. The link is in the description below. So yep, this was the sticker price on this vehicle. Now let's carry on this review starting from the exterior side of this vehicle. Coming towards the front side of this vehicle, now the first thing you will notice is this fine shield like design front grille which is Genesis signature design grille. Integrated within itself you will find the camera. The camera at the front as well as on the side and the rear gives this vehicle a 360 view angle that comes very much in handy during the tight parking spots. Now running within the front uh, bumper you will find the front sensors. Coming towards the headlamps right now you will find the fine horizontal split design headlamps with integrated daytime running light over towards the hood you'll find this fine control design uh, lines running over towards the uh, running on towards the front hood of this vehicle and right at the front windscreen you'll find the camera that helps with the lane keep assist just to quickly show you the complete view of the front the color that you see on this vehicle is the Cardiff green so yep I'm quite impressed by the design the unique design that the Genesis carries for its vehicles so now coming towards the side this sports prestige edition will give you this fine 21 inch alloy wheels then you have the body colored side mirrors with lane change indicators and cameras underneath it then you even have the body color door handle coming towards the back you will find the tail lights kind of shadowing the front look of this vehicle the front uh, headlamps you have the split horizontal design tail lights then this is the gb70 genesis and right at the back you will have the backup sensors as well as the camera as we are behind let's go ahead and check out the cargo space on this vehicle so it does show an impressive amount of cargo space for your day-to-day -day items and luggages at the back you will have some nice pocket space on the side then you have the back light as well as a 12 watt power outlet then this space can be further extended by folding the second passenger row seats which is as simple as this let's put on the level which shall fold the second passenger row seats we shall give you this extra space if needed and checking out the spare tire and the spare parts over here which are right underneath this so yep this was about the cargo space so let's go ahead and close this with the push of a button so yep, this was about the exterior side of this vehicle and the cargo. Now let's go ahead and check out the interior side on this vehicle. Coming towards the front side of this vehicle, on the driver's side at the door you have all your window controls, lock unlock, side mirror adjustments and folding. At the top you have the memory seats. Right at the bottom some nice or some decent amount of space and speakers. Coming towards the seats it comes, it comes with some fine premium leather seats with power seat adjustments right at the bottom. Taking a step inside. So once seated, you are greeted with this fine leather stitched steering wheel which has a variety of controls on them such as your volume controls, your hands free, your mode select, controls to navigate through your fine information display screen for the driver. Just going through some you have your drive info, accumulated information, attention level, tire pressure and much more. It even shows you, it even activates the cameras on the side to give you that easy, uh, easy to change lanes. And it kind of helps with the blind spots so it, that's one of the preferred options also I like to have it onto a vehicle then coming towards the center you have a fine 12.3 inch in front entertainment display screen currently it was on the map then you have your navigation menu radio media HD radio data phone connected services phone projection voice memo setup valet mode seats as well you can set it to your comfortability then you have your quiet mode as well as climate you can adjust it from here as well as from the screen below I'm going back towards the home screen and it has a very quick response that I really like and then coming towards the bottom you have two AC vents then your climate controls, map, navigation, favorite, radio, media and setup then your different modes select, your comfort, eco, sports and sports plus. 
and then you have your knob to navigate through your uh, display screen in a different drive select and your two cup holders on the side as well as some nice space at the side of it you have two USB inputs at the armrest you have some spacious uh, space underneath the armrest as well as the 12 volt power outlet checking out the glove compartment which is spacious as well then a quick peek at the top you have the sun shade with the mirror and light then you have the panoramic roof with the controls also at the top and then you have your light buttons and that's pretty much about it from the front side now let's go ahead and check out the second passenger row seats coming towards the second passenger row seats on the door you have a window control lock unlock at the bottom some decent amount of space and speakers taking a step inside so it does feel a lot more comfortable you have a good amount of legroom space behind the front seats you have some nice pocket space at the center you have two ac vents with the controls right underneath it and right at the bottom you have two usb input inputs and a power outlet then on the side mirrors you have the curtains and at the top you have the handle and the light and you can even adjust the passenger seat at the front as simple as that and checking out the armrest now which has two cup holders so yep that was about the second passenger row seats now let's go ahead and check out what's underneath the hood this 2023 Genesis GV70 comes with a 2.5 liter turbocharged engine and has a horsepower of 300. Let's go ahead and have this closed. So yep, that was my review on the all new 2023 Genesis GV70. Do let me know your thoughts in the comment section below. Thank you so much for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe.